Well, India has also launched a new bank that will help finance its many entrepreneurs. The Indian government will now give loans to small businesses that had little or no access to formal financial institutions before. CCTV's Shweta Bajaj has that story. Jay Prakash runs a small business in the bylanes of a colony in New Delhi. He started his business of dyeing cloth in 2008 with $1,000, money he managed to save. In the last six years, the business has grown, and now he wants to replace his stoves and kins with machinery. But the documentation meant his application for loan was rejected. I went to many banks, but I didn't have the required documents, and because of that, banks rejected my loan request. But I still started my business. I want that government to give us the loan so that we can make our business big. Jay Prakash is not alone. Small businesses in India employ a massive 120 million workers, but almost all function outside India's formal economy. Finally, there is a window of opportunity. The Indian government has launched Micro Units Development Refinance Agency or Mudra to help these small businesses. With a corpus of $3.2 billion, Mudra will give loans up to the value of 16,000 US dollars. In areas of business, in areas of self-employment, in areas of industry, all people who are at the bottom of the economy financially, they will be our biggest clients and target group. Most people in small businesses come from economically underprivileged backgrounds. Mudra Bank, which will work through partners in various villages and states, will cover small businesses like repair shops, street vendors, artisans and small industries under it. The banks will work like a microfinance institution, giving loans at low interest rates. According to government estimates, there are nearly 58 million small businesses in India. Out of these, only 4% have access to any sort of formal financial institution. Many of them end up going to small money lenders who end up charging them as high as 25 to 30% in interest rate. The whole point of funding the unfunded is to include all of them in India's formal economy. Traditionally, banks do not give small and unorganized businesses loans because of lack of paperwork like residence proof, since most of them are from villages and the banks doubt their ability to pay. People like Jay Prakash are happy and are already making plans to expand their businesses. Today, we do our work manually. If I can get a loan, I can buy machines and with that, my business will grow at least two to three times. Recently, India also launched a program to bank the unbanked. Under the plan, millions of bank accounts have been opened and the target is to open 150 million bank accounts by 2018. Combined with Mudra, small businesses would now be able to get loans and this would save India's poor from fraudulent money lenders who are their main source of credit. But the key remains execution. Shweta Bajaj, CCTV, New Delhi.